A Cumberland County teacher is accused of hitting a disabled elementary age student in the back of the head. CBS 17 Sheena Elsey went to that teacher's home today to ask her about the accusations. This is where I'm told it all happened in a classroom at J.W. Coon Elementary, where this woman, 37 year old April Cottle, was teaching a special needs class. But according to court documents, when the janitor walked past the classroom, there was only one student there, a 10 year old disabled student who normally wears a helmet. But he says the helmet was not on. Then the janitor claims Cottle yelled at the student and hit her twice in the back of the head on that October day. In looking at the case, there were several people in the school system that were interviewed to make sure that, you know, we were doing the right thing. Cottle was arrested and charged with misdemeanor assault on a handicapped person on Monday, but she's not in jail now, so we went to her house. Hello, how are you doing? Are you April? No. Cottle's mom answered the door and told me she didn't want to talk about it. Talk to the lawyer. But court records show she told investigators, quote, I'm going to lose my job or worse. In a statement, the Cumberland County School District says she's now suspended with pay and has been since it happened back in October. It seems to be a trending thing that's happening. Um, I don't know if we're having younger teachers with less patience. I, I couldn't begin to comment on why this is happening. Um, I don't know. Cottle is now the third Cumberland Schools teacher in the last year charged with assaulting a student. In Fayetteville, Sheena Elsie, CBS 17 News.